Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below. If you need to get in contact with me, let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see what is going on for my Taurus collective. What is going on for my Taurus collective? What's happening? Okay, the three of pentacles. So you're trying to rebuild. Work, 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 work. Maybe working with, living with, working on something. Contract, legal, legalities. Um, a lot of paperwork also. This could be co-parenting. This could be cohabitation. Yep, this could be doing some real, you know, quality work. Putting your work out there. Your works, your body of work. Someone could be looking over your work and saying, wow, this is really, you know, high quality. They want to collaborate, pay you for. Let's see. What else is going on for Taurus? Okay, yeah, this is you, your energy, the Empress. So you're all about creating, creating abundance, creating a level of um, luxury. You're using your gifts. You're opening up. Some of you could be singers, writers, or um, you're just really putting yourself out there. You can be mothers or you, you, you want to become a mother. Or are you creating solo? Nine of swords. There could be somebody in a place of darkness. It could be because you guys are separated. Something got expelled or was, yeah, it came out and it was like a rush of energy and you were forced to do something about it to make some choice to leave to the wands to stop giving to a situation where you you just didn't know where it was going and it could have been karmic some of you were like in some long-term girlfriend boyfriend situation here something happened to the point where um, something came out, it was made, you were made aware of, it was known. It could even been that. So the tower is like people being thrown out, could be thrown out, expelled from something. Or, you know, this energy pushes you to a place where there is like, you know, some force, maybe even force of nature that pushes you. Um, to have to make some choice, some healthy choice with the lovers. Healthy choice over some karmic, stuck, stagnant, tough situation, drudgery, burdensome. You had to make the choice where you're going to stay in this or come out of it. What else is going on for Taurus here? What do we have for Taurus this week? The Page of Swords and the Death card. So you're going through some deep transformation. Ending, beginning. Something's ending, beginning. There's some relationship that ended. I don't know if you're still hanging on to hope or... The Death card sometimes talks about temporary pause. like, But it only you can only come back together if there's been true transformation. This is your energy wanting to come out the Knight of Pentacles. I don't know if you're still stuck on something. You need to let some transformation happen. There's a butterfly here. Then you have the Death card talking about transformation. I don't know if um, Page of Swords, you're, you're still concerned about being nosy in regards to still wondering about wanting to know someone else's whereabouts information getting tarot card readings um just digging into uh gossiping about you could even be the subject of gossip or you're gossiping about or gossiping or trying to gain some awareness about somebody else's position what they're doing where they're at if they want you back if i heard where did they land
if you've been in some false relationship, Ten of Cups with the perspective card or the hangman, you need to ask yourself, how did you get there? If you feel like you got duped or you got taken advantage of, what part did you play in that? Turn your world upside down and you'll gain clarity. Look at something from a different position. Maybe about someone from the past who was very persuasive in their words. Maybe was very, you know, tough. And they, they talked to you kind of crazy with the Knight of Swords or they would be confrontational. Um, you need to ask yourself, how did you get here? Why aren't I getting, why am I not getting the outcomes that I want? Because you played the part in that. You're the common denominator. Um, there might be a, a, a break or a hold off to just somebody who wants to call a truce with you, come back together. There's a temporary pause of you understanding or you needing to understand what part you play in your life so that it doesn't happen again. So you can make better choices because it looks like you will have some fortunate opportunity after this difficult period. But it's like the universe is saying, look, take a step back and realize how you got yourself here. You're not oblivious to what's happening in your life or what happened to you. I heard even write it down. Maybe you believed lies. Maybe you were easily deceived. Maybe you just wanted something to happen so badly, so greatly that you were lo overlooking extremely big red flags. Let's see. Yeah, the second house assets, material world possessions, finance. It looks like you're going to build up credit score. Get more security for yourself. And that's your house. The second house. Sex style. Opportunity. I knew it. With the Ten of Cups. Some opportunity is going to come to you. Maybe to collaborate. Yeah. Somebody wants to collaborate. Maybe even assist you. Something's going to bring insight. What's going to bring insight to you. Is maybe a conversation. Or um, maybe you're going to drill down with someone. About what ha what's going on in your life. You're going to have some conversation. You're going to communicate. And then you're going to have. Um, more welcoming feelings toward newness. Towards bringing in um, new energy. So it's like some profitable opportunity meets you now that you're not in a space with a person that doesn't mean you any good. You're not collaborating with someone um, who was either collaborating with someone else. Yeah, Pluto transformation. Something's going to completely transform for you. Renewal, um, intensity. You know, it's something being exhilarating, uh, intellect, instinct also. So it's just about you completely transforming, coming out of this different. So this isn't victim mentality. Yes, something happened or maybe you were taken advantage of. But people can't do to you what you don't allow. Um... Yeah, Venus, love, maybe you were, your style, your taste is changing. Looks like you're going to have like an upgrade from the universe. Scorpio, yeah. Uh, the animal, so it's just like you're going to transform, you know, your passions, your intensity. Uh, you're going to learn how to be a little bit uh, mysterious. Um, understand when you're being manipulated understand carnal desire and then actual physical desire could have been dealing with a libra the idealist somebody who was indecisive they couldn't decide on you this is someone who you lived in a home with or something about the home you need to take some time for self-care so you need to stay home Yeah, you need to stay home um, and just take some time to maybe rebuild, redo, reframe, or restructure. Forgive yourself and then forgive others. Okay. Um, 
you may live in a house with women or women or somebody wants to live in a house with you or you have a good circle of friends. Maybe that will help you move forward. Let's see. Yeah, reconsider. Someone wants you to reconsider. I don't know if it's a good idea. Get your own personal reading. Um, you need to reconsider something. Oh, you need to reconsider how you got here also. It's up to you if you want something, if you want to take someone back. That's what the universe is saying. Um, but you need to consider all options. Reconsider. Within the next few weeks, you may be proposed with something you may with an opportunity also we did have a sextile opportunity come out be assertive be confident when you speak with when you talk about yourself because you're ready for maybe abundance um there are helpful people some of you may be in a job opportunity it's coming to you in the near future and reach out to people who can help you. Something is coming to you in the perfect timing, okay? This is what I have for you. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you. Um, go over to the website and book your own reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. You can catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.